move and start moving around. So what we wanted to do is take a quick break, uh, evaluate what we just did with the city council, and then we're going to march around President Street to the headquarters and do the next part of the action. Okay. Uh, the purpose of the city council meeting was to get council president to meet with Sandtown residents. Did that work? Yep. Yes. yes. Right. Yes. Why, why did it work? Pressure. Pressure. Numbers. 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 Preparation. Preparation beforehand. We prepped him in prayer. 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 And a very strong clergy presence today from a lot of guests, uh, institutions, congregations that joined Build today plus builds 35 year history. So when you walk in to the Board of Estimates with a build t-shirt on, it's a very different reaction than you walk in as an individual organization or an individual neighborhood or an individual congregation. Amen? Amen. Amen. So the purpose of us gathering together is that we stay together. So if you're a guest here today, we welcome you to build. We need to grow more power in order to get stronger reaction from uh, the city. What did you learn from the city council president's reaction? Anything stand out to you? He's defensive. He's defensive. He's a little agitated. A little agitated. Um, right? Why, why do you think he's like that? Well, he was unhappy we were there. What's that? He was unhappy that we were there. Yeah. No, they made him comfortable that people showed up. Challenging authority. Just walking into the board of estimates with this many people, people. particularly as Bill, is an interruption. And build that's okay because this city has to be interrupted for the powers to be to listen to residents and neighborhoods. That's how Bill created uh, the Nehemiah Homes in Sandtown. That's how Bill created the East Baltimore Preston Place housing, the living wage. You're part of history moving forward, but if we don't have the courage to interrupt, then it's not we're not gonna get the reaction. I also think uh, Mr. Miles, you know Council President well, Pastor Prentice, Pastor Keene. There's something else about the Council President. He doesn't know how to accept a win. <laughs> he was he was briefed before this. He knew what we were coming to do, and all he had to do was stand and, and was stand or sit and say, "I build. I, I understand you. I'm with you. I've been all over the city. Of course, I will go to Sandtown and meet with the residents." He doesn't know how to claim his own power and his own position. <laughs> Is he mad at the mayor for, because he's saying, I, I, the, the, the police chief doesn't work for me, the police chief works for me? No, that's what he's taking to dig it up. And, 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 and as if we did not already understand that the police commissioner works for the mayor. We were asking him, and he was briefed about this. We're coming to you because the mayor, we know the mayor is not going to direct the police commissioner to meet with us. We're asking you to use the power of your office as the president of the city council to intercede for us and to ask him to meet with us. Is he like that even when the media is not there? Yes. yes. He, he, he just said it. He doesn't know how to accept the win. Accept win. You already prepped the man. That was a win right there. Yeah. That was even said. We're respecting you yeah. right now more than we're respecting the mayor. But he didn't get it yet. He was too agitated by the presence right. as if we were trying to take something from him and actually instead of trying to recognize him. That's it. And we're going to keep trying to help him understand that, but we're not going to wait on that. But we did get him to say what? We're going to meet. So we have what we want. That's right. So we got our, our first win moving forward, and we, the council president definitely committed to a meeting. They're going to contact us by the end of the day. Uh, uh, Melissa Kelly and, and Becca. That's right. And William we got a Greer. William Greer. Yes, we do. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, Melissa, what, what did we get from the uh, staff? We got a commitment to a meeting. We got, we got a commitment to a meeting for our Sandtown residents. Based on your time schedule at 6 p.m.? Yes, that is correct. They will be calling at the end of the day to determine the time and date of the meeting. Yay. Great. 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 Great.